seen as the rollout ramps up, a challenge has been getting the life-saving drug to minority and underserved communities. And a local pharmacist has made it her mission to do just that. Eight on your side's Melissa Marino joins us live in East Tampa. And this is one person doing the best they can to really make a difference, Melissa. Absolutely. So this is Health Matters. This is a small black-owned pharmacy. They just received hundreds of the J&J &J single dose vaccine. The goal is to get it to some of the hardest hit areas from the pandemic. Here we go. It won't hurt. <laughs> At the Health Matters Pharmacy, getting people vaccinated has always been a mission for Dr. Vondalyn Wright. When the pandemic hit, she knew it was even more important. We've been disproportionately affected by COVID-19. Um, we don't necessarily believe that it will happen to us, but it's happening in our communities. For months, she has tried to get a supply of the vaccine to help the African-American community, which is often overlooked. She worked with Representative Diane Hart and this week was able to get 200 doses of the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. They hope this single dose shot will help reach more of the community that may otherwise be hesitant. There's a 28 day wait. There's more chance that people may not go back for that second shot. So having the ability to have that one shot one time is critically important. So if you're interested in getting a shot, you can log on to their website and sign up. And then she said, just come in here. It's a very easy process. She expects to keep getting more and more doses. And she's going to be traveling out in the community at 5 o'clock today. She's heading out and going to give about 20 of these doses away to a group that signed up. Stacey? Uh, it's working like, I should, like it should. It just it takes a long time. I'm wondering, I, I think a lot of people maybe have a preference for which vaccine they would want. She made a very good point about the J&J &J one being only one shot. Um, is she hearing that people have a preference? She, yeah, actually she is. And she says she tells every single person, get whatever dose, whatever vaccine that you can possibly get. She says, don't be picky, just get what you can get. But she did also say she's very happy to get the J&J &J vaccine because she does believe that is going to be instrumental in getting more folks in here and getting their shot. Yeah, no need to make sure they come back for the second. That makes perfect sense. All right, Melissa Marino live. Thank you.